kcal.com. Imagine losing weight or quitting smoking just because someone tells you to. Well, that's the theory behind hypnosis, power of suggestion. It's certainly not for everyone, but we talked to one man who says it worked for him when nothing else would. And with every breath you take, I just want you to tell yourself that you are relaxing even more. What you're watching may look strange, but it's not, at least not to John Rodriguez. It's a hypnosis session in progress. All the sounds around you, they do not distract or disturb you. In fact, all they do is help you concentrate on the sound of my voice. Just concentrate on the sound of my voice. Lee Betchley is a certified clinical hypnotherapist. Rodriguez, her client. Deeper, deeper. Like millions of other people, John wants to lose weight. After trying just about everything, he very reluctantly turned to hypnotherapy. I, I believe it now, you know, I, I was a skeptic. I didn't believe it, and, and yeah. now I do. She's teaching me, you know, through hypnosis, you know, to put better, fo uh, better foods inside of me, not to eat the bad foods, um, to motivate myself to work out, uh, because I was not motivated to work out at all. And now you are. And now I am. It's really amazing. So what exactly is hypnosis? Lee Betchley says it treats the brain like a computer, using the power of suggestion. Hypnotherapy basically reprograms your computer. It bypasses the critical mind. The critical mind is that area that decides whether it's going to accept or reject the suggestion. A quality foods for a quality person. Sometimes I can remember her saying that, and a lot of times I don't remember what she says at all. Betchley says hypnotherapy can be used for just about anything. I wish that I wasn't shy. I wish that, uh, you know, I would stop biting my nails. You know, I wish I could be more motivated. I wish I could be more organized. Lose 10 pounds. Or lose 10 pounds, yeah. Hypnosis is not for everyone, but it is working for John Rodriguez. He's lost about 25 pounds in three and a half months. It's going to stay off. And so I'm, I'm certain it'll stay off. Rodriguez says hypnosis has also helped him with a certain addiction he couldn't shake, Coca-Cola. At least two or three uh, liters a day of Coke, because that's my coffee. Now I don't even drink Coke. It's more water and iced tea. What do you say to skeptics who think, oh, there's no way this can work? Try it. <laughs> There you go. For more information on this, or if you'd like to contact Lee Betchley, you can do so by calling 818-486-9219. Again, that number, 818-486-9219. And John Rodriguez says his sessions have also helped him become much more confident in his personal and his professional life. Very interesting. I mean, we sat through it, and uh, it was fascinating to watch. Is this a one-shot thing, or do you have to keep going? For to it, it depends. Each, each client is very different. She stressed that. It depends on where you're at in your life with the particular issue you're dealing with, whether it's smoking or weight or confidence. And uh, so it could be once a week, once a month. It could be spread out longer. It just depends on the person. So it's not a one-shot thing? No, but it doesn't go on forever either. I mean, eventually you get to the point, like John, where you learn, you, the, the behavior you've learned becomes a part of you. And you've gotten rid of the old behavior. In his case, for example, drinking all the Coca-Cola. Um, yeah, a lot of Coca-Cola. And so once he made that connection in his mind, it's basically playing the subconscious against the conscious because you've been trained to do something all of your life, like let's say not working out, eating a lot of fatty food, well this untrains that behavior. It's okay. really interesting, but again, not for everybody, but it certainly works for this guy, and we wish him the best. Yep. Okay. Thanks, Silva. Okay. Coming up, Carl Bell will be along with...